Welcome back to the show. We've got just over 26 remaining minutes remaining in what will be an all-time heat between two classy goofy footers, Jacob Wilcox. We got pretty close to cracking the code and getting himself uh, to the top end of the Challenger Series last year. Up against Evan Geiselman, uh, a competitor that's always been lauded for his approach. And uh, many saying that this could be Evan's year. And here he goes, this one during the break. Just got to love the flow, Rich. Oh, just flying. Let's have a look at Evan Geiselman's right first. Yeah, so uh, Ev just coming around the section here. Quick snap back into the pocket. Lines it up again. Huge snap and then the finishing floater. So good three-turn combination. But this way from Jacob Wilcox. This was something special. He really had to work down the line to get to the sections. And now he starts to wash off the speed. Bang, right up vertical, tight in the pocket. And again for a second time. Look at the spray coming off the board. Wow, and the third one. Just got better and better with each turn. And uh, this ride just standing up through this inside part of the sandbar. And Jacob just so in control. Really deep on the bottom turn. Throws it up high. Love to see him get a, a similar size size wave because, you know, he's got that uh, same electric back end. And here it is on show for you. Love his low center of gravity. This guy, you know, he's, he's so well-rounded. Good in big surfer as well. He's, uh, his front side air is uh, just unbelievable. A lot of pop. You're probably not going to see too many of them today, though strengths and uh, and throw some big power hits at, at Jake, Jacob Wilcox here. Yeah, this one was a bit of a smaller wave, but beautiful surfing and really well-timed hits here. As we see now, having a look at this one, Jacob Wilcox up again, looking to back up that 7.33. Nice transition off the bottom there into that pocket hit. As he looks to build down the line now. Got a clean flow happening on this ride. And really string these moves together seamlessly. What kind of finish can he put on this one again? Just throws a dagger at the closeout with Jacob Wilcox here. Here's the replay of that last wave as we uh, take it in from the Gold Coast flight cam. Great vision. Oh, look at these snaps. There is a difference here. Ebb's a little quicker off the top. Jacob's carving through the lip there. Really connecting with these sections. Just beautiful vision here. You can see mixing it up. Each backhand turn a little different from the other. Projecting down the line on that one. Gets straight on the heel side rail. Slams the lip again. Just this wave. Just uh, really standing up in front of him. Just inviting these perfect little place turns. But I like it. I like that he's uh, using the rail a little bit more on these set waves. And you're right. Let's get Ev on one of these ones and uh, really start getting a battle happening. Yeah, 6.93 is the number for Jacob Wilcox out of this ride. Wilcox willing to take a chance on this one. It's actually bowling out pretty nicely. And he rides high on the face to get some speed for this oh. turn. Super explosive, did well to drift across that lip, maintain control, find that hillside rail again and get back up into the bowl for a couple more turns. Oh. Explosive. He's had some decent numbers already, but the judges have almost been asking him to give more. Those first couple of ways going, what have I got to do here to get into the excellent range? Flying down the line here and just does a full little lip grind. Whoa, that was fast. Just held onto it. And then uh, just does a check turn here and then uh, squares up again. This one, back into the pocket, comes nice and high. Getting the board vertical on these hits. And then, uh, yeah, just thought, I've done enough here. Didn't chase down that final little section, but that's critical. <laughs> that is a really critical manoeuvre. Yeah, loved it. I'm, I, I feel like they're going to go high on this one. Yeah, I think... I think Jacob's got that gratitude. And it's uh, been a really strong performance here. From the uh, surfer from Margaret River, Western Australia, he's moving on through to the quarters. 
yes, he is. Evan Geiselman, positive signs for him. And showing some great form earlier on in the contest.